Hello and welcome to a new video of PenPot, the open source design and prototyping tool for the whole team. Today's video is about a new functionality that we already released a few weeks ago, which are prototyping animations. So, as you know, we till now we have uh, basic iterations, uh, but now we improve them. So, let's get into it. Okay, so let's start. Uh, first of all, here we have our beloved app, Plants App application, and you know, it's a library and a template that you could easily download from here. Our libraries and template section, where there you have a lot of stuff. Uh, our design system, uh, another interactive music app, Coco Material stuff, and of course our plants app. Okay, so to start, uh, where are all these new uh, advanced interactions uh, settings? So if you change to prototype mode and select an artwork, you will see that here at the right sidebar you have. Uh, the, the flows which are a new functionality uh, the flow is uh, uh, very important because you can set different flows uh, in the same page or in the same prototype so uh, it, it sets uh, where your prototype uh, start you know the start frame and all the navigation through it okay and then uh, when you share your uh, prototype uh, you can e you can easy uh, switch between flows in the view mode we will see uh, in a few minutes so to start i'm going to to use a few a few screens of this of this template i'm going to start in the in the home uh, screen so i'm going to create a new flow uh, double click to rename it uh, i'm going to name it and then hit enter okay so uh, now i'm going to start using all this new stuff I'm going to create a new um, interaction, which are when I click on this uh, item, this plant item, I'm go I want to navigate to the detail uh, artboard. Okay, so I create this interaction by drag and drop the the arrow icon and we create an on click interaction okay so open the settings and here at the bottom i have all this new stuff okay all this uh, panel is uh, reworked okay so now at the bottom you, i'm going to select between the new three animations uh, i'm going to pick uh, dissolve and when I click on this on this item I'm going to go to the detail page by doing dissolve and of course I want to go back so I am uh, going to select the go back icon and drag and drop the interaction to create another on click navigation you, as you can see navigate to home home is the the artwork I'm going to go to okay so but now I want to create a different animation, probably a bus animation uh, with this uh, kind of animation, okay? And a push from right to left. So I want to select this option. As you can see, you have four, the four options. So let's see. Here we are at the view mode of our prototype. Uh, as you can see, I have six artworks, but I start the flow at the home artwork because I have the search flow uh, created and selected here. So as you can see, I can uh, check all the artworks of my design, but my home artwork is selected as the first, okay, as the start. So. Uh, if I go to interaction and show interactions, uh, we can check that uh, this uh, element, this plant item, it has an animation. So if I click on it, I have this dissolve effect and go to the detail artwork. And 
if I show the animation the interactions here I can see that the go back icon is highlighted because I have an interaction so if I click on it I push back to the home okay in order to create this search interaction this search flow I'm going to pick this search button and drag and drop the interaction to the search screen okay I'm going to um, select another dissolve and here in my search uh, screen I want to go back to my to my home screen okay um, I mean this is a model screen so this uh, this search uh, model uh, appears overlapping the home screen so I want to select the background the model BG and go back to the home screen by doing probably a dissolve is out and for this interaction I'm going to select is in which is cool in my opinion okay so let's see how it works at the view mode here we are again at the at our view mode uh, which our search flow selected and if I highlight the interactions you can see that I have now two interactions the plant item and the search icon okay so if I click on the search the pop-ups come in okay and if I click you, you can see that the cursor changes to the to this uh, pointer uh, cursor so if I click on the background I go back okay so these animations and more are now available on Penpot as you can see I have now two flows one for the search interaction and one for the shipping and you can manipulate all this new stuff from here with all this new uh, slide boost dissolve animation so please let us know if it helps you in your prototype work and follow us for more thank you so much so if you want to know more hit the subscribe button and follow us on twitter mastodon uh, instagram uh, because we will have a uh, news soon so thank you very much